Wartburg Castle, is perched at a height of some 400 meters, above the delightful countryside, south of the city of Eisenach in Thuringia of central Germany. What makes Wartburg Castle such a magnet for memory, tradition, and pilgrimage, is that it stands as a monument to the cultural history of Germany, Europe, and beyond. Wartburg Castle blends superbly into its forest surroundings, and is in many ways the ideal castle. Although it has retained some original sections from the feudal period, the form it acquired during the 19th century reconstitution, gives a good idea of what this fortress might have been at the height of its military and seigneurial power. It was during his exile at Wartburg Castle, that Martin Luther translated the New Testament into German, marking the creation of a unified and accessible written German language. The veneration of Saint Elizabeth, which extends far beyond the frontiers of Germany, includes Wartburg Castle where she lived and worked. The patronage of Hermann I, Landgrave of Thuringia, occupies an extraordinary place in the creation of a national literary tradition. In poetry and in legends, Wartburg Castle, bears an undying reputation through the names of, Walther von der Vogelweide, and Wolfram von Eschenbach. While these authors represented the first steps in German literature, and Martin Luther's translation of the New Testament, Wartburg Castle is also associated with the beginnings of a bourgeois and democratic nation. The artistic and architectural importance of the palace, built in the second half of the 12th century, is no less significant. In execution and ornamentation, it is unrivaled and represents one of the best preserved secular constructions, from the late Norman period to be found on German soil. Thanks to this broad range of religious content and historic data, and because of its significance in the history of the arts, Wartburg Castle attracts around half a million visitors every year, from all over the world. 